Oh no, I, I confront the teacher. Oh. Welcome back. Welcome back. All the keys have been returned. Truly stupendest work. The things from the world, well, none this time, it seems. In the pages, oh, it seems there's only one. Well, that's fine. Just means a lot of blank pages. Clean the black notebook. Now, what will you do? I imagine you're quite tired. A way to wake up from the dream? It is not quite a dream, but yes, I can tell you a way. There are two ways. To link the world and your world. One of them. Well, let's just say it wouldn't, wouldn't be an option for you. The other is for Alice to stab this key into the one they feel is most evil. Here you are. Wait! So the multiple endings depends... On... On who? Who How we think is evil and we just stab them? Jesus fucking Christ! <laughs> That's the right... That's right, I've also unlocked the final door. Which way to go is up to you, Alice. The Alices are unstable in this world, so if they stay long, they'll return to foam. Sweet dreams. What, you're an Alice? Everyone in this world's called Alice. Oh! My actual name is Alan in this game. Oh, okay. So, okay, so that's interesting. I was thinking, wait, I'm pretty sure the character you're playing is a little boy. Oh wait, the XXXX thing for Trio of this game, it actually means love. Oh! So the one, the, the girl before, she was saying those without love are dead. Damn. Oh, that's, oh, that's... She was speaking a harsh truth I didn't know about! Oh! And she decided to kill herself rather than to live in a world where she's not loved. Oh, that's dark! Why is that dark? I... I don't think she's a brat anymore. I think she was feeling lost. She was a version of Snow White that had nothing. After all, Snow White had everyone. She had everyone and then they died. Oh, good. Top case. I don't know. Yep, there's everyone. Everyone's alive. Who the fuck are you? I think you need to save. I came oh. to take a, a look sometimes, but eventually... Eventually he came to do all the cleaning, food, and such himself. Ah, sorry. You kids help too, don't you? And I don't do anything. When we were in college, he never cleaned anything. He'd have everything scattered, leave it, a candle lit, and finally just fall asleep in the reference room. You s say he's not so different now? Ah, he never learns. Well, he's a good guy. Very strange. But if I tell you anything, is that your teacher's a good guy? I still don't trust the teacher. I don't blame you. And you said the next step is to confront the teacher? Or... Dr. Teacher here, yeah. Hmm? 
Ah, uh, if you want to play, let's do it tomorrow. I'm sure you're tired too, aren't you, Addis? Good night. Handle. Huh. Oh, here we go. This is oh, new. Oh, is that his, the teacher's door? Yep. Oh, what the fuck? We're about to find out the teacher's trauma. Yay! Oh! There are ghosts. Hmm. What? Is there something on my face? You already know where this, this is, don't you? Oh, the key to the next room? You want the key? Well, could you bring me a ribbon? A red one would be nice. I'll give you the key for one. <laughs> I'm not sure if you heard that, but Busta sneezed. Uh, oh. That's what it, it, Did you hear it? No, I didn't, but that sounds precious. Oh, sorry. I was concentrating. Mind playing a little game? I'm getting bored. Well, sure. I'm glad. Just imitate the sounds of, it, of the animals I tell you. No, no. It's not embarrassing. I'm the only one looking. Alright, let's go. I only say it once. Cat, dog, frog. Meow, bark, ribbit. Or... Meow. Meow. Wolf. Ribbit. Correct. But there's more. Cow, cat, frog, cat, pig. Should be moo, meow, ribbit, meow, oink. Moo, meow, ribbit, meow, oink. Right. You're pretty good at those imitations. Gosh, I really enjoyed that. Right, have these. Obtain leg warmers. Oh, nice. Let's play again sometime. Okay, so that's not a ribbon. But not what we need. Oh, you've got something good. Can you give that to me? Sorry, but it's just so cold. Thank you. Ah, so warm. Can I make one more request of you? I want some warm soup. The ingredients are all in the kitchen. Oh, yes, and I want it heated. So there's just a little bit of veggies left. Thanks in advance. Hey. Just a fucking errand boy at this point. Meow. <laughs> Ugh, I don't know the answer. And no pen either. I feel like the only person not demanding things from you is the cat. And that guy right there. Well, he he's kind of saying he wants a pen, but... Awful. There's vegetables. Take them. Take vegetables or scrap paper in the basket. Hey, notebook scrap. Oh, this is about the teacher. Bad people should be... Uh, oh, it, it looks like at first it's supposed to be killed, but we know XXX is love. Loved. Then everyone will be happy. That's what, my, what the cat said. Why would loving them do that? And did the cat really say that? I don't even know that for sure. You should just love them. Ah, I'm sleepy. Good night. Fine. Boil the vegetables. Keep boiling. No more. Vegetables melted. Failed. Put the, the failed soup in the corner. Boil vegetables. Keep boiling. Never mind. Successful soup. Obtain soup. <laughs> yes. And I see that someone's in the matrix typing uh, all the numbers. Uh, I'm not in the matrix. <laughs> oh, you've made me soup. Thank you. I'll be having this. 
The soup it has no flavor. No, that's fine. It warmed me up. Ah, uh, thanks. Ah, uh, yes, this. I obtained a pen. I just yeah. bought a new pen, so I don't need that one anymore. I'm sorry for calling the ghost person a bitch. You you made it for them and they're like, it has no flavor! <laughs> I don't work for you. <laughs> yeah. You you have a pen? Ooh, thank goodness. No, no, thank goodness. See, I can't figure out this problem. It's not like I have to solve it, but it's it, it'd be good to load off, you know? So there, there's this type of cat. They're very strange cats. After 10 days, they get pregnant, and in 80 more, they have kit, they have kittens. In 10 more days, they're pregnant again. At first, they have two kittens, one male, one female, equally divided. Next time, they have four and six. And the kittens, after 40 days, become adults capable of pregnancy. And we have one of these stra strange cats right here. She, she's white, cute, and fluffy. If I keep her for one year, how many will I have in the end? That's the question. Would you tell me if you get it? I'll do my best to figure it out, too. I want to see something, so I'm going to... I'm going to be stupid and say one. What, why would you say that? Center says... Okay. Hey, yeah, tell me. Wait a moment. Oh, you're right. Wait. <laughs> I was being stupid. And my stupidity helped me. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's right, because a cat can't get pregnant by itself. It needs another cat. <laughs> Accidentally correct. Yeah. Wait a moment. You're right. What? Only one? Why? Ah, that's right. She won't get pregnant without a partner. Ah, I feel, I feel kind of let down by myself, mostly. No, it's fine. Thank you. I feel so much better now. Well, I'd like to reward you. How about this? Do you want this? It's absolutely fine. You can take it, if you like. Obtain a red ribbon. Will you put it on? Should I put it on for you? Just kidding. I know that my oldest sister asked you for this. Wait, the messenger boy, aren't we? This is the easiest puzzle thing I've ever solved. Oh, wonderful. You brought one. Thanks. I always lose my ribbons right away. Here's the key as promised. In the passage key. I have nothing else for you. This, you want it? It's not very useful for notes. My pen won't write on it. Obtain a notebook scrap. Oh. Bugs flew all around me. I walked along the ground. A chair talked. I was surprised. A cat saw it and laughed like a fool. Everything got strange once I opened that door. But I don't know which one is strange. Is it me, or is it this world? Oh, I just don't know. I don't know anything. It looks Tetris Cat again. <gasps> Shit! I saved in the wrong area. No, foot doesn't infect the other endings. Who? No, you don't need to say it. Because neither do I. Are you lost? I see. Well, so am I. I've searched all over this place, but I can't find it. Do you mind if I come with you? Alright, thanks. Maybe with someone else, I might find something different. We need to borrow the passage key again. Let's go to the director. Me? Right, well, call me what you like. I hate my name. Anyway, nice to meet you. This is definitely the teacher. Calendar. What day of the week were you born? You don't know? Well then, tell the date. 
Sunday, the Sabbath day. Excellent. Me, I was born on Wednesday. Not many people believe in this sort of thing, but I do. <laughs> Maybe it runs in the family, given my mom and dad. Oh. Monday's child is fair of face. Monday's... Oh yeah, Monday's child is fair of face. Tuesday's child is full of grace. Wednesday's child is full of woe. Thursday's child as far to go. Friday's child is loving and giving. Saturday's child works hard for a living. And the child that is born on the seventh day is bony and blithe and, and good and gay. <laughs> Just remember back then, gay meant happy. Yeah, but it's still funny that nowadays... <laughs> good and gay. <laughs> I mean, it's everyone nowadays. If you're born on Sunday, you're gay. <laughs> Do you know what Bonnie and Blessy means? No. Bonnie basically means attractive, and uh, Blessy means cheerful. So, you're, it'd be someone who's pretty, they're cheerful, they're a nice person, and they're happy. So they basically dumped everything nice on Sunday and everyone else everything, the leftovers. Oh. I was born on a Wednesday. Oh. I'm sorry. My my life is filled with woe. Yay! Happiness all around. <laughs> I wish I was born on a Sunday so I could say I was born to be gay. <laughs> oh, hello. Good day. Mr. Director? Um, I want to go into the middle room. Can I borrow the key? Hmm? Didn't you borrow it earlier? I mean, it's fine, but make sure to return it. Ah. But only if you can solve my riddle. If there were three of me, I'd be able to eat three apples in three minutes. If there are a hundred apples, a hundred of me, how many minutes would it take me to eat them all? Well, if it... Oh, wait. Jerry, can you hear me? Jerry? Hello? What? Hello, hello. Oh. Discord kept it, it Hi. Would... I was Dis... a little confused. Okay, yeah. now I think I get it. Yeah, Discord was just not letting me speak. Uh it was like, okay, so if there are three of him and three apples, he would eat them in three minutes. If there are a hundred apples and a hundred of me, how many minutes would it take to eat them all? It it's it's a hundred. No. They said a hundred of me and a hundred of the apples. Yeah. One minute. One minute. Oh, right. One minute. Solve, solve that and I'll give you the key. But only if you... But you only get three shots. Stuck director? Only three. No more, no less. Tell me once you have it. Hmm, huh. You got weird all of a sudden. I don't know why, though. All right. Think it over carefully. I'm not the only one being asked. You think about it. Oh! Yeah. Yeah, 100 apples and 100 of me. It would it'd take one minute. Alright, let's go. Wrong, too bad. What? I think it, because it's, it's, I think they're saying all the apples, not just one apple. Oh well, yeah, but he said 100 of me and 100 of the apples. And it sounded like it takes one minute to eat an apple. Therefore, they would eat a hundred of the apples at once. Okay, so it's not that either. I told you! Are you fucking kidding me? You want- I'm gonna tell you the answer. You're gonna get mad. Oh, it's three minutes. Fuck you. Yup. Yup. <laughs> it's the same amount. Correct. Alright. 
check the far right bookshelf. You have to listen to what the heart says. If you don't, your heart will attack you. There's various books. Pick it out. Question two. It took three of me three minutes to eat three apples. Now that's the minimal number of me it takes to eat eat a hundred apples in a hundred minutes. Pesky heart. We don't have time for this. I'll leave this to you. Even closer, there's another paper. A notebook scrap. The ant told me that the frog is bad. The frog told me that the cat is bad. Oh, this was said at the beginning of the game. The cat told me no, the rabbit is the worst of them all. So I loved them all. Because we found out that X of it. it it's, the game wants you to think it's killed. But it's loved. I'm not sure how I feel about the teacher. I thought he was good, but I don't know anymore. Question two. It took me three of me to three minutes to eat three apples. Now that's the now, what's the minimum number of me it takes to eat a hundred apples in a hundred minutes? So... Uh... Again, only three shots got it. Then tell me. Tell me. Just the number will do. Would it be f I want to guess... Four? <gasps> yeah! <laughs> Math! I have big brain. Correct. The key, yes, here you are. And the key in the middle of it. Imagine, like, in going back into your high school, if you had to do all this to get the bathroom, get a key to go to a bathroom. <laughs> so many people would be pissing themselves. You would never get to go to the bathroom. Yeah. The school would be sued. Yep. Good. We got it. That surprised me. No, it's nothing. Still gonna check this. What is this? Ah, be careful. It's cracked. Sorry, my hand is cold, isn't it? I'm sure it's because I don't know warmth. You're so kind. Now I realize, only now, much too late. Your hands are warm. I guess I go in here. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, dragon killed a person. What? As you can see right here, there's just a person who's dead. Well, yeah, but you said dragon did. Yeah, so? Dragon's not here! Not yet. <laughs> Anyways. Cold. He was dead when I got here. He, I'm so scared. Who found him first? Um, the person next to me, but he hasn't said a word. This seems complicated. I don't even care about that guy. I'm more concerned with not being able to play outside until this is settled. Hmm? Yeah, he was a great guy. Really. Calm down, calm down. I was telling him I'd go visit him tomorrow, but it seems like he was troubled. Swissa seems to know something. Excuse me, could we talk? Ah. He seems to be deaf. Do you know sign language? I see. That's a problem. How else can we talk to with someone who's deaf? It's a hard words and charts. These are mine. It's probably too much for you still. 
I did all kinds of research a long time ago, that is. I was praised for it and even won awards. I don't, don't do that anymore. No, it's not really because I got tired of it. Uh, well, I guess it's also true. I'm not being, I'm not good being around lots of people. But really, white, white couldn't be a less appropriate for me. <laughs> this sentence, white couldn't be any less appropriate for me. <laughs> uh, is it because in European culture white stands for purity or is it because in Japanese culture white stands for death I don't know but like outside of that it just sounds like race <laughs> like the guy just doesn't like white people <laughs> slow strange to zone. You don't notice? The map of the world. The world is so big. Plus, in different places, they eat different things and speak differently. If you're interested too, maybe I can take you around the world. Oh, hi, Hatchet. Bitch. Uh, we're trying to figure out uh, who did the murder. That gives me literally no information. What? What is the murder? Uh, there's a person dead in the library, and there's a bunch of people. And we're trying to get something to talk to the deaf kid. Mm. There's, there's, like, paper and what looks to be a pen on the table over there. I already, t uh, mess I mean, I already hit enter on that, and it's just... Talks about his past. Mm. A feather pen. It's not lit. Yeah. Wait, I mean, it's a library. You might be able to find a, a dictionary of sign language. There's a book titled About Space. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. It's so vast. Uh just thinking about the space makes me realize how puny I am. Well, you're a child, so you are small. But fuck you. Jesus. What? Rude. I don't give a fuck. Oh, wait, I can leave. Eh. Communicate using the dog. Oh, Hatchet, I actually beat the Tetris thing. I mean, got oh, to level nice. 7, which is the highest level, and got an achievement. Are you proud of me? <laughs> Mildly. Hot. My chicken tendies are hot. Oh, you kind of missed, um, one of the children, uh, called Stella. Yeah, the way they spoke, they were not as bad as Cindy, but they were being a total bitch. Damn. <laughs> Until we realized what her issue was. Yeah. And, um, what was worse is the fairy tale they were representing was uh, Snow White. Uh, Only if, if Snow White was loved by everyone and then everyone died, leaving her alone. Yeah. And then she committed suicide. Yep. I'm glad that now Twitch allows us to talk about the game using the S word. Oh, I should... Uh, uh, no, you're fine. No, oh. you can say it. It, it. As long as it's within the game, it's all good. Oh, yeah! That was definitely within the game. That was that was horrible. Thank you, game. You made me feel bad for who basically sounded like a Cindy. <laughs> I'm just checking everything. But 
Label Mother Goose. Oh no. Oh wait, I gotta read this hat shit. It's it's it goes with the days on when you're born. Alright. Okay. This is your thing. Uh, you want me to read it? Uh sure. But you'll you'll like the last a... one. There you go. Want me to give it a voice? Sure, go ahead. But what voice should I do? I mean it's uh Mother Goose's uh sto th rhymes thing, so I don't know. I guess I'll pick at random, and by that I mean pick the one I was going to use anyway. I just looked up what day of the week it was on my birthday. It was a Sunday. Fuck you. <laughs> you'll, you'll understand why Jerry said fuck you in a moment. I come to think of it, let me go check what day it was when I was born. Yeah. Right, yeah. you checked the day you were born. Yeah, I already did. It was Wednesday. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, November. <laughs> Trust me, Hatchet, when we get at the end of the rhyme, you'll, under you'll start laughing as the and understand why Jerry said fuck you to the game. Hmm. What's this? Monday. Oh, I was I was that. born on a Monday. Well, you have a fair face. That's a lie. <laughs> also, as proof that I was born on a Sunday, I put my exact birthday in the voice chat thing. Okay. Anyway, Hatchet, go ahead. Monday's child is fair. <laughs> Monday's child is a fair face. Tuesday's child is full of grace. When they when 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 Wednesday's child is full of woe. <laughs> yeah, this is me. Thursday's child has far to go. Friday's child is loving and giving. <laughs> Saturday's child works hard for the living. Oh my god. Here comes Jerry's. And the child that is born on Sabbath day is Bonnie and Blythe and good and good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you know, Bonnie is another way of saying pretty. And Blythe is saying, like, a happy personality. You know, it a good person. And you... <laughs> well, they said gay. They didn't. Life, life, life knew happy. that you were going to be born gay. Uh... So. You're gonna be gay later in life, so they, they just mainly put you on Sunday as being poor. Okay. Uh, so, <laughs> so, uh, good looking, a good personality, and gay. <laughs> I thought you would enjoy that. Well, just so you know, Considering how uh, thick my skin is, I'm pretty sure the pores on my face are permanently deep. I will never have an attractive face, so. Tell that to the Huns. Damn it. Oh. I see, with the paper and pen, I guess we can write things to each other. Oh, what is it? A pen? Sure. I don't need it anymore. I don't have any paper. One of my sisters might. Ah, uh, what to do? Let's... Let's get the paper from somewhere else. Wait, I wonder oh, if I can find... On the paper. I wonder if I can find the. Okay, I gotta, I gotta search up the Alice Mayer cat puzzle. What? There's a lot of weird puzzles. The only one I helped solve was by accident. 
It was on flowers. I was instantly like carnation. Uh. Okay, so let's go all the way down here. The only puzzle I helped solve uh, was basically just me saying, all right, just brute force it. <laughs> I figured carnation because carnation is actually a flower that is well known for being mistaken for roses, but they are not roses, they are carnation. Hmm. But unlike roses, they never have thorns, so they will never hurt you. Unless you're allergic. Well, yeah, but that's, that's not part of the, that's not part of any riddles. If you're allergic, all the flowers will hurt you. I think they're hypoallergenic flowers. Huh. I'm gonna find the fucking... Puzzle. Because I want to say it to hatch it. like chicken tendies. All right. All right. So, see, I can't figure out this problem. It's not like I have to solve it, but it'd be a load off, you know? So it's this type of cat. They're very strange cats. After 10 days, they get pregnant. And 80 more, they have kittens. And 10 more days, they're pregnant again. Hold on, it's loading. At first, they have two kittens, one male, one female, equally divided. Next time, they have four, then six. And the kittens, after 40 days, become adults capable of pregnancy. Then we have one of these strange cats right there. She's w white and cute and fluffy. If I keep her for one year, how many will I have in the end? That's the question. Hatchet, what's the answer? You think I'm going to do math right now? Hatchet, think of this. If you have one cat, how many kittens will you have in a year? Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> well, knowing my household, probably three. And I am back, Danger Noodles. Let's get... Now we just need to find paper. Paper? Yes, certainly. I just have this writing paper. Oh my, it's you. I'm looking forward to your book being completed, you know. This again? Oh well, thank you very much. Uh... Okay, so now we can talk to the deaf kid. Wait, right. Yeah. Before you do this, mm -hmm. uh, are you sure you should be the one to write to the deaf kid? That could cause some misunderstandings. Oh, I will end you. <laughs> Hello, yes, I am very extremely excited. Hold on. Do you know anything about what's going on? This isn't the language they speak here. I'll be fine. You know, the one language, right? Yes, I haven't taught you. It's too soon for you children to do that kind of study. I'll give it a shot. Give me some time. Alright, here we go. There was a detective who talked to each person here. But suddenly the lights went out and his throat was slit. Seems he had, he had poor hearing. Before he died, there are five people in the room, the same ones here now. We, call, 
We'll call them A, B, C, D, and E. They are asked what they were doing before the murder. A. I was doing some reading here, then it suddenly went dark and I dozed off. I didn't know he was dead until I woke. B. He was murdered? Really? He wasn't a bad guy, though. To stab him with a knife like that. <laughs> C. Uh, I just... I want to play outside. I, I was just here for some tools. I don't know anything about him. Why did B just not explain anything as to what they were doing? Right. D. Calm down. I can't believe he was dragged here. Those footprints are big, so it must have been a man. E. Yeah, I was here, but I left right away. He wasn't even here then. I know the answer, but you have to answer. <gasps> Fuck you! <laughs> it has to be someone else who interferes with the heart. Those are the two culprits. Good luck. What? Someone who interferes with the heart? Hmm. I'm already thinking B, because they didn't explain anything what they did. Yeah. So B is obviously... Also, earlier when Woodbright first entered the room, she said, Dragon killed them. Yeah. Uh. I'm also starting to think about this, because they're just trying to calm down everyone. Maybe trying to hide that they did it. That or they're trying to calm themselves down. A lot of- it, when people die, people tend to panic. And sometimes you repeat that to yourself just to calm yourself down. It's a pretty scary situation. Calm down, I can't believe- I can't believe he was dragged here. Those footprints are big, so it must have been a man. Oh shit. Uh oh. Well, I'm gonna put my guess for B is, is one of them. Yeah. Right, let's just put D, I don't know. Oh shit. I was right. It was B and D. Is this the second time you randomly guessed and got the right answer? <laughs> Anyways, right, I explained it, and he seems to understand, so it should be fine now. Killing a person, what an awful thing to do. Let's go. Are you going? Yes. What the fuck? It's a bed. Oh yeah, there was actually a end the guy character's story hatchet. Um, uh, the guy right. child. Uh, there was an area where you can go to the guy's bed, where there was, where apparently, they didn't say it outright, outright, but it was emphasized that it, it is porn that was hidden in his bed area. <laughs> and mm. I got an achievement for it. What was the achievement called? Hold on, I can go look at it. Man's Needs. Mm. I see. A strange book, isn't it? But lots of people have read it. I've wrote it, but the name is my friend's. Yes, I hate it. I know I've, I've told you that again and again. The name itself is great. My teacher gave it to me. But I hate myself so much for not living up to the name. Okay. Damn. Yeah, each each area has been dealing with someone's trauma. Is this guy's trauma just him hating himself? It's blotted out and unreadable. So, this is where I, we parked. Oh, I honestly don't think I could think of a more common trauma. Uh, 
Just like sustained self hatred. Right. This is my world. This door leads to my current world. It's very tiny and still restricted. It's open. Why did it come to this? You're smart, so perhaps you know. If you know the answer, tell me, Alan. Obtain the shard of... of... Oh, yeah, we found... Yeah, we found out what the X means. The X thing means... means love. Yeah, it was the trivia of the game. It means love. Extra porn. <laughs> Mother. Father. I have to go. Oh, no, my kid's no, no. starting to get memories. No, no, no. Better. Wholesome porn. Locked. There's a diary. I bought a house, well, it was a formerly a facility. It was much too big for me. I can see myself getting lost easily. I was indebted, indebted to Cliff. Once again, I should really thank him later. They misspelled Clef! <laughs> Today I met a girl. A few days ago, she was found near a house that burnt down and seems to be the daughter. She insists that someone other than her... There's someone other than her, and it's, she seems to have another personality. So I gave her double the furniture and such. I wasn't sure what to do, but at any rate, I found research, found a research subject this way. She's now in my care. What the fuck? What do you mean? I fucking knew not to fucking trust the teacher. Wait, wait, what? Wait, 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 what? Yeah, they're oh. studying the student. Or it's not student, the child. No symptoms at the moment. I met a second girl. I received a letter three days ago. They had all the particulars. Perhaps because of what she's been through, she's much less cheery. She's reluctant to talk to, with me. She's enjoyed talking with the other girl. Um, albeit not for very long. It may be slow, but I'll try to get her talking with me. No symptoms ah! at the moment. This guy's just studying on children, and I don't know how I feel about it. I feel like it's less studying and more like, is he drugging me? No, I don't think so. It's, he keeps saying no symptoms. Maybe. No I mean, symptoms. they could. I mean, they could have some kind of illness. True. The third, I met a boy. I was surprised, but given his mother, I decided to take him in. He talks plenty, but he's illogical. He was a little awkward with the two girls, but they're playing together a few days later. Hey, he kept putting frogs on my head. He's a bit too mischievous. No symptoms at the moment. It's just Is this just me as a kid? <laughs> it's tacking mm -hmm. frogs on people's heads. <laughs> I met the, the fourth, a girl. She walked from a town in the woods. I talked with her, and she told me about a new mysterious illness. In infinitely, it wiped out her town. Does she have a resistance to it? I'm a little interested, but it's unrelated. She doesn't want to talk about it much. It's hard to talk with her. She doesn't talk with the others, just playing the piano in her room. No symptoms at the moment. All the children have the potential to break out, but still no symptoms. But are there even symptoms? How did it go back then? I'm getting a headache. I'll stop for now. The pages were ripped out. I met a fifth child. He was outside when the incident happened. They say the shock caused memory loss. At a glance, I was surprised it's just a hunch, but he must be on the verge. I'll watch him very carefully. <laughs> Two seasons passed since then, and... What have I been doing? I feel like my chest is burning. See the scene in my mind again. This must mean yes. Very soon. It must be over soon. My head hurts. Ah! I'm sorry, Fiona. Scrap of paper in the back. Take a notebook scrap. When I came to, it was my usual world. She's still sleeping today. I loved lots of people, but I never loved. Why is that? 
Ah, uh, should I have been loved more? But there's no bad people left. There's only good people around me. The cat says only bad people can love. Which is right. Which is right. I don't know. I don't know a thing. I just keep trying to love people so I can be loved. I keep trying to fuck people so I can be fucked. Which is kind of really bad because he's surrounded by children. <laughs> that I would like to take back that statement. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't mean that he's doing it, doing anything suspicious with the children. <laughs> he could be going out on the town. The day Hatchet gets cancelled. Alan, if you're here, then no. The cat can't be trusted. You really are proficient at breaking promises. It's quite troubling. That key. It looks sharp. Give that to the teacher, would you? Right away. Now. Hide behind your back or give him the key. You see, I was given a choice for multiple endings that I choose who to stab and kill. Hmm. So, very well. This might hurt a little. I'm sorry. What? Oh, and he's dead. <laughs> it doesn't even hurt. Now, that I, now I can end this awful dream. Yes, it's the end. Will you hear my story? This isn't my first time in the world I've been here before. Nightmare Syndrome. As an avid reader, I'm sure you've heard it at, at least once. It's a disease that keeps one from waking and takes their soul. The cause is said to be unknown, but I believe it emerges in children whose hearts are in darkness. Have you not? Have you noticed? I took in hurt children with nowhere to go, helped them, and let them live with me. But secretly, I observed and studied them as children who might acquire the sickness. I must have upset you. I'm sorry. I want to destroy this world and these dreams, whatever it takes. I lost someone important to me right before my eyes in this world. Ever since then, I've thought of nothing else. It was my selfishness. So when you arrived, I was very surprised. Maybe. Because you reminded me of myself back then. If I made you unhappy, I thought you would acquire it, but I couldn't do that. Soon my door opened, I should have come alone. The rest of you were taken in as well, and the entrance grew bigger as a result. I tried various things, but nothing worked. Alan, though you opened the door, you did nothing wrong. It's all my fault. There, there. There, there. There, there. It's okay. This is my dream. My world. I hid too much of my weakness before I knew it. I was drowning in more than I could manage. So I have to end it for her as well. I'm not very smart. She often told me so. I researched long, but I guess it was all for naught. Take this. I obtained a locket. I couldn't give you what you wanted most, because... I was never given it. I don't even know what it's like. Sorry. If you have nothing, then you should make something. You have wonderful friends all around you. Just take it slow. You're smart, Alan. So you'll be fine. Right, I'm an adult. Allegedly, so they won't eat me. I'll figure something out. There's a number for a man named Cliff on my desk. Say my name and he'll come help you. He's one of one... He's my one and only friend. He's very kind. You'll be fine. Please, forget about me. And no one will have to come here again. Good night, Alan. So the teacher wasn't a bad guy. He was still a horrible person. Yeah. I Even if he was collecting the kids to try to figure out a uh, solution to a disease. He was still doing it without talking to the kids or explaining what he was doing. 
He's literally mm-hmm. researching them without their knowledge or approval. Yeah. There's a reason that's illegal. Yeah. Anyways. I damned the notebook scrap. Why wasn't I loved? I thought I could love then, but I simply wasn't able to do it. Because I didn't know how to love. How will I do now? I lost everything. I have nothing. Oh, I'm so sleepy. Love me. Someone please love me. Oh, that's, that's depressing. He yep. was evil, but that was still depressing. That's one of the endings. I think it just ends. I don't know. I'm not taking back that he's evil, because he is. I, I honestly yeah. don't put much stock into that statement. Into evil as a concept. Not a good person. Yeah. I understand being desperate for love and wanting to hear something, but you don't break the law to do it. There's a reason the law exists. Those deaths. I don't see anything here. Not a desk. It's locked. I'm sure it's been stayed locked. Wait, can I not just explore? Oh, it's the teacher. No response. I can either leave him be or just stare at his face. You know, why not? Look at his face. I wanna save. Look at his face. Teacher. Good night, teacher. Oh shit, that's an ending. It's a good oh. thing I saved before it. <laughs> Okay. Just, you just creepily stare at your teacher when they sleep. It's an ending. I think your teacher's dead at that point. Yeah, but also in that room contains the ending of the shards of love. Oh. So. I guess I'm just questioning how immoral his actions are. Well... Because, like, if he's taking good care of the children, and all of this is also to help stop a greater harm... He never said if there were treatments for it, only that there was no cure. Well, yeah, but if he's studying it, then that means he's attempting to find information about it. Well, he yeah, specifically, but it also like he like that if there were there were treatments that he wouldn't be giving it to them. Well, There's he could be reason. trying to de- he could be trying to develop the treatments. Well, yeah, but you'd still need to tell the kids. It's even if he's trying to uh, develop a cure for something, they still need to give their consent. I mean, I agree with that. I'm just, like, questioning how it's, like, specifically seriously bad. Well, one, we don't know if there is or isn't a treatment, just that there isn't a cure. And so if there is a treatment, it means he's keeping it away from them so he can find the cure. But sometimes there isn't a cure. To a well, the the way that he was talking implies oh. that there is no treatment. Oh. Well, treatments don't always cure. Sometimes <coughs> things well, still continue to deplete. Well, yeah, but he was specifically talking about wanting to 
avoid anyone having to deal with this awful thing again. Thus, I think that he would be giving them the treatment if such a treatment existed. Uh, Alright, anyways. Read. Oh. I don't know the code for it. Basic controls. No, that's... Not what I'm looking for. There's a number for a man named Cliff. Sure... In a note from Teacher Slocker. It's the boy from earlier and a girl who resembles him. In this note, I'm in beverage but not in drink. I'm in hurt but not in pen. I'm in XIII but not in scene. I'm in drizzle but not in ran. I'm in car but not in automobile. Oh, I think this is supposed to be the name for the diary. Okay, so I'm in beverage but not in drink. What? Oh D Cause drink. Hmm. Yeah. I'm in hurt, but not in pen. Pain. Pain. Yeah, pain. So D A. I'm in V I I, but not in C. V I I is also seven. Oh V. Oh. Is it could be like Dave or David? I have no idea. I'm in drizzle, but not in rain. Not uh, in rain. So, oh wait, I just read the what? answer. Hi. I. I. It's David. It's David. Because it says I'm in car, but not in automobile. It's David. Wait, how does the automobile card thing work? Cause I'm in car, car, card, but not an automobile. Uh, another word for automobile is car. Just take the car out of or car and get D. Oh. Yeah. The... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The puzzles in this game is weird. Pick it right. Oh, do I have to capitalize it? I don't know. Or do I just have to capitalize one part? Oh, I have to capitalize one part. Alright, here we go. I've returned to my own world. Fiona stabbed herself with a knife. Well, that's just one way to start oh. off a diary. <laughs> Was it Fiona who had that dream? Then I must be dreaming too. No, I don't want to lose her. To sacrifice her. Fiona is still sleeping. The demon will eat her soul. There's not much time left. With all my teachers given me, I can go to school now. I'm rather reluctant too. I got involved with one particularly annoying person. His... He's named... I was pretty sure it was supposed to be his. Uh, what? It just feels weird he's to me. His name Cliff. Yeah, I've never, I never seen seen the word H E apostrophe S. So that's why it just bothers me a little yeah, bit. It's, it's shortened. He is. Yeah, so I know. He's named Cliff. He is named Cliff. Yeah, he he is named Cliff. I don't want anything to do with him. I pray he can let me have some space. That evening, Fiona's soul was lost. I wasn't in time. Now what am I going to do? I'll play with Cliff again today. He told me some interesting things. I was wondering how it would go when he dragged me out. He's a good person. Very good. So, teacher is retiring tomorrow. Seems she's having a child. I'm going overseas. I'm anxious, but Cliff will be with me. So I should be fine. 
Apparently my novel won a big prize. Cliff submitted it somewhere. I got in a, a little fight with him over it. I told him if we are going to be popular, I'd use his name. Then went to my room. I don't have any interest in that. I've been having the same dream lately. A dream of that day. Is she angry or is she suffering? I have to destroy that dream quickly. There might be another like her or like me. Just what is love? Maybe I do know. I suppose first, I'll repair our friendship. How many years has it been since I said I'm sorry? And that's the ending if you go ahead and collect that, all the sh love shards. Hmm. Oh! The panels are different this time! So I guess it's going to look different each time. However, uh, Hatchet, I accidentally saved over the area where I can choose the other endings. So I have to go back, finish one of the endings, and go to the others. Very good job, Brian. <laughs> Isn't she lovely? I just heard one of the pirates just exclaim to himself, It hurts like a mother when I pee. I should have used a condom. Yeah, the next endings are we choose who we're going to stab with that key. Mm -hmm. It's mainly to choose who we think is, I think what the rabbit said was most evil. Three of the people didn't act the most evil from the four endings they can choose to stab. Because, like, I'm not counting the one we just did. Because, like, teacher stabbed himself. <laughs> Anyways, now we get to go on a butt stabbing stabbing free of stabbing children. What the fuck are you saying? <laughs> I don't know. Now oh. we get to go on a butt stabbing stabbing free with children. <laughs> yep. Oh, there's more. Good morning, teacher. Hey, look, another uh, look, another one came today. Ha. Huh. We're gonna run out of places to put them. Laddie is the same as ever, always eager to play. Chelsea is slowly starting to talk to others. She's very good at cooking as well. Joshua told me he found someone he likes. Still always looks weary of our, our antics, but she seems to be having fun. Mr. Cliff and the others who look after us are all very nice people. There's no way we could forget. We'll always think of you as our teacher. So we'll destroy the dream and save you. We absolutely will. There's a very low chance of success, but we are looking for a way. Until then, we will keep sending it. That thing which you said you didn't know. Until then, good night, teacher. Aww. And receipt of love. Recipient of love. Oh. That's cute. 